so with <coughs> the haggis, we have turnip, potato twill, whiskey and green peppercorn juice. So, the haggis we're going to roll in a, like a phyllo pastry foie de brique. The turnip, we're going, we have puree turnip and we also have spaghetti turnip. On the potato we have a crisp twill, which we do the potato like matchsticks. Season it with a little bit of butter, salt, and we cook it in between two trays. Okay. Okay. So, potato. Some salt. And a little bit of melted butter. Seasoned enough. And then we just take spaghetti. Make a nice round. Okay. Quite rustic. Okay. Take the grease proof on top. Another tray on top. Just press it lightly. And then we put that in the oven. Okay, so haggis. Okay. So normally we'd let it sit out for a wee bit just to soften it up. So, make it into like a round. So basically we're making a posh, posh spring roll. So, we'll have a little bit of flour and water. A bit of another sheet. So we just make a paste with the flour and water. Again, just lightly. So, Nice and tight, we need the pastry to be nice and tight. Just fold it in. So we're keeping the haggis inside there. Okay. Just make sure that it's sealed. A little bit more on the inside of the pastry. means when I'm rolling it, it's nice and tight. Okay, it's all sealed in. Turn it, it's done the same way as what we did the potato. Put the machine, nice and fine. Spaghetti, and then turn it puree. With the trimmings that we have from that, we just sweat that down. Okay, so just take the excess butter off. Here, let's trim up the edges. At an angle, and you've got a haggis supper. Okay. Finish with your potato crisp. Okay, and that's it.